You know, I hear from people sometimes that have the perception that Louisville has turned into some crime-ridden place with violence everywhere, and it's like the New York City in the 1980s. It's just not the case, folks. Um, is there some violent crime and some crime? Of course. There's, there's that in every city. But I live right in the middle of the city. I feel safe every day. Um, most of that, the violence that does happen is pocketed, and it's not random. Um, it really is just not the case, but I actually have five reasons, maybe a bonus too if you're good, uh, about why people are moving to Louisville in 2022, right after this. Hey y'all, I'm Neil Cox with Judah Real Estate Group right here in Louisville, Kentucky. On the Living in Louisville, Kentucky channel, we've been putting out videos about every week and we're trying to give you guys information about our wonderful city of Louisville. Louisville, but it's Louisville when you're here. Uh, if you want to make sure to see all of the videos that we're putting out, click the subscribe button below and all those videos will come straight to you. But even better, click the little bell and you'll get a notification when those, those videos come out, right when they get posted. Um, but if you're one of the people that are thinking of actually moving to Louisville, Kentucky, um, you're gonna go one step further. You're gonna get out your phone, you're gonna email or text or call, or of course, sound that bugle. We're gonna get off to the races and make your move to Louisville, Kentucky a great one. Um, Real quick, I've heard from several folks here lately um, that have reached out from the channel, and I want to thank everybody that has reached out. Um, not only do I love the city of Louisville, Kentucky, I love meeting interesting people, and I've met people from all over the all over the country here very recently. So thank you. I just want to want to say thank you. It, it's good to know that folks are watching and find this helpful. Um, I'll mention it again at the end, but if there's something that would be helpful that we're not providing, just ask. So why are people still moving to Louisville in 2022? Um, it is, there's a lot of reasons. I'm gonna break down five of them right now, plus a bonus. Um, number one, it's affordable. Um, as, you know, with mortgage rates going up and with cost of living going up everywhere, Louisville is insulated from the wild swings of, of different things, um, you know, where, where your money in California or New York is not going to get you nearly as far as Louisville. Property prices are are a lot lower than a lot of the country. Not the lowest, but they're below average. Um, you know, two hundred fifty thousand, you can get a great, you know, three bedroom, two bath, two bath house, um, basement, maybe a garage and a decent area, and that's just not true in a lot of places. And there's there's not the wild swings on things like food costs and, and things like that. It just stays a, a, a good cost of living. Uh, I appreciate that. Um, and if you've got one of those jobs too, you know, with things going remote, um, a lot of people live in more affordable places but have that kind of big city type job here lately too. So that's kind of an advantage. Number two, opportunities. Opportunity is everywhere in Louisville. Our unemployment rate is still very low. Um, it's, it is very similar to neighboring states like um, Tennessee, Ohio, Indiana. Uh, I think Indiana's got us beat okay. They must be getting them to work. Um, but there's just all kinds of opportunity. There are warehouses being built just to the south all the time. Um, healthcare is actually a, a, it's a pretty big hub. UPS right here in Louisville and all kinds of other things. Um, there's also, you know, we've got sporting events, we've got music, we've got parks, menus. There's just amazing stuff to do, and it's all here. It's all right here. Number three, the weather. Now, I know some folks might not like the weather. Um, yes, it gets fairly hot. We're having a pretty hot summer here. But, you know, folks that are buried in 20 inches of snow up north, they might like coming to Louisville and finding that some years we hardly get any measurable snow. Some years we get one or two, but you know, six inches is a huge snowfall for us. Um, it just doesn't snow here that much. The Ohio River, um, I'm not a meteorologist, but it does something about making it not snow as much here. Um, if you live in, say, Florida or Southern California, 
you know, some people like the, the break of having actual seasons. We have all four seasons. Um, fall is my favorite. Uh, summer, I suffer a little bit just because I run hot. Um, it's been hot this summer, but it's unseasonably hot. It's not usually up in the high 90s for a prolonged period of time. It just really isn't. But you get four real seasons. You don't get tons of snow. And yes, it gets hot, but it's not like South Texas hot either. So it's, it's kind of a good middle. Um, it can, you know, can you find a, a more temperate climate? Yes, but you're not going to have all four seasons there. Number four, great food. Um, I've got a buddy and we like to go check out new restaurants all the time. I mean, this is a metro area of a million people. New restaurants popping up all the time and great food. There's some um, recognized chefs nationally that, that operate in the Louisville area. Um, there's one guy, and if you come, I'll take you there. Um, he's been on the Food Network several times and some of those competitions, and he's done a really great job. He's got a really cool restaurant right in the Highlands. Uh, it's really cool. Uh, I, I will take you to it if, you, if you're in town. I'd love to. But there is a variety of food. There's tons of ethnic options. There's vegetarian. There's vegan options and everything in between. So number five, slower pace of life. Um, if you go to Los Angeles, your commute might be an hour or two and you're not even going that far. Uh, that's unheard of here. So around, you know, rush hour, five o'clock in the afternoon, it gets a little congested sometimes, but you know, here we're talking about like a, you know, I was home 10 minutes later. Oh, the traffic was so bad. I'm telling you, traffic is not bad here and it's really cool. Slower pace of life, if you're sitting at a stoplight and you're the first one and you're not paying attention and the light turns green, you get a lot of leeway before you get honked at. It's almost uncomfortable for me because it's like sometimes I, you know, I'm in a rush to get where I'm going and I want to honk, but we just don't do that here. It's like you know, one, two, three seconds, still no honking. If you miss the entire light, I've seen it where nobody even honks. It's very, very peculiar to me but we're just polite like that. There's that, that kind of Southern politeness, but I really do think we've got the heart of a Midwest town. Um, it, it's, it's just kind of an interesting mix. We kind of sit right in the border. Um, you know, we've got a downtown, but it's not a huge, crazy spread out place. There's just, there's just a little bit slower pace of life than some other big cities. And then my bonus one is come here and see for yourself. Louisville is not what you expect. Um, we're a little smaller than some of our surrounding cities, but we have nearly as much to offer them. Um, people are, are not, you know, crazy rednecks that, that do whatever. There's a, there's a mix politically. There's, there's a lot of art and culture and really cool things to experience here. Um, people get surprised when they come. It's a great place. So there you have it. Five reasons people are still moving to Louisville. Um, my prediction is that over the next decade, it'll get discovered and we will likely see some, some pretty good growth. Maybe, maybe not. Um, if there's something that you'd like to see on the Living in Louisville, Kentucky channel, let us know. Um, put a comment below. We're looking to inform. So if you've got a question, ask it. If you've got a video idea, just, uh, you know, let us know. Um, remember to subscribe because I want you to see all the videos and click the little bell so you'll get notified when we post a new video about every week. Um, and of course, if you're one of those folks that's really thinking about making the move here, call us, email us, text us, sound the bugle. We're going to get off to the races and we're going to make your move to Louisville, Kentucky a great one.